one of the first things we always do is check the device's temperatures, make sure its frequencies are correct, and check the health of the battery and storage unit. We use the software to run all these checks quickly and precisely. Now we'll run it and see what temperatures we get. The screen is extremely small, so it's a bit tricky, but in terms of the processor, memory, and all the processor phases, we're not seeing any high temperatures. Everything is working perfectly. Now we'll stress the video processing unit inside the same processor. So here we're stressing the GPU again, and we started the stress test once more. In terms of temperature, we're looking good. Now we're gonna do the test while it's connected to the charger. Here we have it plugged in, and the temperature is a bit higher because we're stressing everything. The CPU fan is fine, and everything indicates that there's no overheating issue. We can see that after playing for a few minutes, when temperature is rising, it's hitting about 82 degrees. We keep running tests until we reach any failures. Here we're running another test, in this case for Merck, at 1920 by 1080 resolution with eight times morphological anti-aliasing. And we're also downloading the Blackmagic benchmark and walking the download speed and everything is pretty stable.